Hey love bugs, it's Rosalind back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed today. I'm doing blessed and highly favored. Hope the same for you. And if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are yet to come for you. And if you have not already, please like and subscribe to my channel. Even hit the notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video and if you feel like you're comfortable enough go ahead and drop me a line or two i love to get the positive feedback especially if you want to express on the content of my video today and if you feel like you resonate with my video please go ahead and give me a thumbs up like and even share it'll greatly be appreciated and thank you so much for stopping by my channel today and for my returning subs what's up fam much love to you Namaste, love and light, love and blessings, and many blessings are yet to come for you. And thank you so much for coming to see about the video today. My video is about Twin Flame 101. Hey, Okas, are you living blind in truth? Um, today, the video, I mean, the music I'm listening to is Ricky Music, Angel Whispers of Emotional and Physical Healing. Meditation Music for Healing Meditation 415. I will go ahead and put the link in the description box below if you'd like to go ahead and meditate. It seems very peaceful. It's like especially angel angel whispers. I think that's kind of, you know, really positive, especially if you really need to go ahead and meditate today. It's really good to go ahead and at least try to meditate at least once to twice a day if you can, if you have time to. Especially if you're at work and you work at the office. You know, try to put your headphones in. Try to find a short no meditation because you might need it because it might be one of them hectic days you know you probably got a lot of files business papers and stuff to deal with that'd be good to listen to but yeah you know are we living blind in our truth there are some people so there are so many people are not aware and not probably paying attention to the surroundings about them how they're going about things their emotions they're picking up on the things that they're feeling around certain people the reason why they stay away from certain places how some some of them might be like to be alone they enjoy their alone time they appreciate their alone time but it's you know it's good to actually you know don't walk blind don't run don't be a person running in you know behind you know blind in your truth walk proudly in your truth know who you are accept who you are you know God gave you this gift for a reason you know, and then sometimes it can seem overwhelming and it's like, you know, you're like, I didn't sign up for this. I don't know why I got to go through this. Technically, many millennia, millenniums ago, you did sign that contract. We have a contract for basically to go through hell until everybody can wake up and realize, you know, something. <laughs> I don't know what that I'm 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 finding that contract and trying to tell you exactly what that contract's about. But it's basically for us to be helping awaken people. And we don't need to live blind in our truth. And there's some people they don't want to accept who they are. And it's like it's not healthy because I know personal experience from running around from the truth, it can cause a lot of damage. It really can. And it's just a lot of regret that you, you know, can save yourself the hassle. Because there's some people, you know, they're not awakened or they just look at you all crazy if you bring up certain things. And it's just like some things will make sense to them. But us, you know, how we are, we will, we will open up that gateway, that Pandora's box. Like, look, there's more than just us out here. It's just like certain things will pop off. Certain things people experience, they might not have experienced before when they're around you. Some people might sit up here and say there are certain things that are special about you. They just can't put their finger on it. But they gravitate towards you. And I hear that so much. So, so much that it feels crazy. Like, is everybody on the army marching towards me? And it's just like, you know, I have so many views on here. I'm starting to get rapid subscribers, which is a true blessing that people are actually wanting to, you know, see my videos every day just to see, you know, what am I, what do I have to say or, you know, what am I coming with, uh, coming up with today? You know, I'm starting to, you know, I'm putting my Facebook page, uh, a spiritual journey um, is a closed group you know, under construction, you know, putting um, links out there for people to learn more about themselves, the way they go about things, how, you know, people might react to them, you know, what things that, you know, why we do the things that we do, you know, just to 
give more information out there for people to know how they are. Why do they go around these things? And just know that we're not there by ourselves. You're not by yourself on these things. And just it's a good feeling to know when you can come across things. And it's just like, you know, technology is like our best friend, but it's our enemy at the same time. But it gives us so much information to absorb the things that we need to know about ourselves. And it's a blessing, and yet it can also be a curse at the same time because it's just like we can be a beast at what we do, but we can also bring so much joy into somebody's life too, so much clarity in somebody's life, and, and, and that's a blessing to do. And it's just like, you know, don't be scared of worrying about what people think about you or whatever because, you know, opinions never mattered anyway. It's just like a butt. Everybody has one. You know, they're just different shapes and sizes. So, but it's just like, we, we need to walk proud in our truth. You know, don't run blind in it. You know, that's not one thing you want to do. I was listening to that Beyonce song and I was like, yeah, you know, I felt like that because I ran from my truth for so long. I had nightmares about it, not knowing what was I running from. I knew I was running from something, but just didn't know what I was running from. And it became very detrimental. It became very chaotic or you know upsetting so it, it's just like i never want to wish that on anybody i want to wish that on my worst enemy to go through the things that i'm going through at this time you know because that you know that could be jacked up and i know there could be something that you're going through that you wouldn't wish on your worst you know the worst enemy you have even though you might want to wish something on them but you know you really wouldn't want nobody going through those things and it's just like you know living your truth don't be blind to the things that you see you know don't brush them off as a coincidence nothing is a coincidence or an accident remember that nobody that comes into your life is by accidents or you know it's a coincidence and stuff like that because it's like more things that i'm learning more about my dad you know finding out there's people that have names in common with like myself and you know my my kids and stuff like that and it's just like it's crazy so it's just like when you expand your your mind and you're learning more about yourself you know you'll feel good you know knowing where you came from or knowing you know how how things work out because i know you know i'm just still figuring this out but there's so much knowledge out there when it comes to hey okas that you can go fish out for if you really want to go and know about yourself but I'm not trying to hold you up today. I was just trying to, you know, download some stuff to you. You know, you may have needed to hear that today. But just don't run blind in your truth. Walk proudly in it. And I'll talk to you later. Keep me in your prayers and I'll definitely keep you in mind. Like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell so when I get ready to upload my next video. Okay? And I will talk to you later. And even, you know, drop me a line or two and I'll talk to you later. Peace. And be wild. Peace. Bye. Love ya.